I spoke to the real Tachanka voice actor. Yep, that's right, Vlad Stokinich, who is the real Tachanka voice actor for Rainbow Six Siege, did a Q&A with me. So why don't you subscribe and enjoy the video? Oh, Chunks here. What's up, dude? Hello. Hey guys. How's everybody? I'm hello. Good, good, good. good. Um, hello everyone, my name is Diesel. Welcome to this very special video. Today I'm joined by my good friends Banter and Chris. Say hello. Hello. Um, and today we are joined by a very, very special guest, the wonderful Mr. Vlad Stokinich. Now oh, I, I hope I'm saying that right. Would you like to introduce yourself to everyone? Well, hey everybody, this is a uh, voice actor, Vlad Stokanich, and I'm the voice of the Janka. The Lord. The, the Lord. Lord. Yeah. Yeah. Praise, Tachanka, Praise be. Praise <laughs> be. Yeah, that is right. We are joined by the real Tachanka. He's taken some time out of his day for a QA. and a um, So first off, tell us about yourself. Well, uh, I was born in uh, 19, uh, 1976 in uh, communist Yugoslavia. And uh, like I said, I was, I was born and raised in Belgrade. And I stayed until I moved to Canada in 1997. And this is where I continued basically my, uh, well, I started my acting career and everything else. But like I said, uh, before I was, uh, well, until, until I was 20, I was in, I was in Yugoslavia. So my question is, how did you get into voice acting? Well, the thing is, I've always, since I was a kid, you know, I was always fascinated by, you know, superheroes, you know, and, you know, like comic books. And you know, for me, it was, it was a fantasy world. And I wanted to belong to it. I wanted to act. I wanted to be part of it. You know, I yeah. would dress up as a kid, pretend I'm a superhero, you know, learn their moves. And, you know, it was, I was always fascinated by it. And it was just a natural thing to me, you know, to just become eventually, you know, an actor and, you know, try acting. Yeah. Um, how did you get to become the voice of uh, Tachanka? What led you to, to that role? Well, what actually happened, because like I said, I started acting and then one of the first roles I landed as an actor was to play a Bane in a Batman oh. game, Arkham, Arkham Origins. Oh, no way! Oh, cool. wow. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. I was Bane. I was the badass Bane. And no I was way. like, you can't even imagine what my agent told me that I got the role. Wow. And I know he always knew who Bane is. Bane is the only guy that broke Batman. And I got to play it. And I read comic books when I was a kid. I mean, for me, it was a dream come true. And then I started auditioning for, you know, uh, voiceover for, you know, uh, and uh, everything else, motion capture, because now I gained some experience, you know, when I was mm. shooting this game, uh, Arkham Origins. And mm -hmm. uh, yeah, and it eventually took off. So um, next question, when you first did your um, voice acting for Rainbow Six Siege, did you do any test recordings for Tachanka for the voice lines? Well, actually, I auditioned for Ubisoft on several occasions and for, for various projects. And I think I did land a one or two, like smaller a day or two days, but this was before. Yeah. And um, for, for Tachanka, Basically, I auditioned and they gave me a bunch of bunch of basically lines that made no sense to me. I did not know. And I just thought, well, it's one of those like one day acting gigs I get, you know, like voiceover gigs. Mm. And I did it and they said, OK, thank you. You know, uh, thank you very much. And that was it. And I thought that was it. But then they called me again, and this time it was a little bit different, like more lines, a little bit different lines. And at that time I had really did not know much about Tachanka, who he is, who he was. But then, like I said, I started reading because I wanted to, you know, familiarize myself with him, who he is. And then I realized who he is. And I, and I, and I, told, I told yeah. myself basically, oh, these shoes are going to be hard to fill. A lot of people's favorite operator, isn't he? That's the thing. Yeah. Okay. I mean, this is, a, he, he is all I play when I play. <laughs> oh. <laughs> I bet you any money, yeah. Oh, that's good to hear. That's good to hear. Is that kind of strange yeah. hearing your, yourself talk to you through the game? <laughs> you, you know, it was in the beginning, but then after a while, how, you know, when you do voice acting, you know, you just get used to it, yeah. you know, hearing yourself. Mm. And he actually helps fine tune your voice. Awesome. And I enjoy it. I love hearing myself. And like I said, trying different things, you know, experimenting. You know, I usually go around the house and, you know, like I'm imagining I'm doing this, like different scenarios in my head. And uh, I'm seeing lines and my kids laugh. Like we all have a blast. We all laugh, you know, so. Yeah. Do they play Siege, your kids? 
They do, yes. Yeah. <laughs> we all play, like, we're like a the gamer family. Oh, <laughs> oh that's nice. awesome. So, next question. Uh, what's your favorite thing about being the voice of Tachanka? Uh, honestly, it's who he is, the character. He's the lord, he's the king. I mean, he's big, he's loud. <laughs> I mean, you know, that's, I mean, I did, I did, a, I did a research. Like I said, when I landed this role, and I did research, and I did research on Russian mafia or Russian communist leaders or everything that I could put my hands on. I was researching, I was reading, I was listening to try to get the feel of who this guy could be. You know, Spetsnaz, anything I could find, you know, anything. You, you probably get this a lot, but uh, could we hear some of your favorite voice lines, if that's okay? <laughs> <laughs> sure, sure. This might get a little bit loud. <laughs> That's <laughs> alright. <laughs> okay. LMG, mountain! Oh, <laughs> oh that's brilliant. Fire they... baby Shumisa! <laughs> <laughs> Let them come! We are not out of the woods yet, Bratan! That's amazing. <laughs> they get serious! <laughs> Oh my god. Yeah, the mic of the, the phone mic is not the same as the studio mic. Yeah, of course. yeah, of course, That's right. yeah. So, uh, we've, uh, we've heard you mention it a few times, but, uh, is the Chanka a communist? Well, he was definitely born in communist Russia. Yeah. I mean, you know, um, being from St. Petersburg, definitely, there was, you know, there was a huge communist influence. Mm. But personally, me thinking like him being who he is. I don't think he belonged to communists, you know, like yeah. or anything like this. I mean, yeah. he would do anything to survive, of course, he's a survivor. Mm -hmm. But yeah. I do not see him as a hardcore communist. Interesting. So, um, so what does Tachanka do in his spare time? I used to be on my own business, but now I sold it and I'm pretty much only do acting. And wow. in my free time, I exercise, I read a lot, uh, anything that would help me find Polish, you know, my craft you know yeah. acting mm -hmm. i have a little recording studio in my house and i always practice you know i play games and i would repeat lines in games with different accents you know different yeah. and you know just playing or because this is something really i i really enjoy doing and uh, this is something i do on day to day just pretty much can you teach us how to do the Tachanka voice? And I'm pretty sure none of us here can do that well. <laughs> no. So I think that's going to be very difficult anyway. Uh... Yeah, yeah. But one of the things about, like, basically speaking, even Russian accent is like rolling those bars. So you really have to roll those bars, comrade. <laughs> I don't want to try. <laughs> I, I don't want to embarrass myself. See if I can try. See what do you, you want to try banter? Go on. Yeah, I'll go. Oh, yeah. <laughs> LMG, reload it! <laughs> well, that's actually pretty good. That's pretty hey. good, actually. <laughs> wow. <laughs> well, okay, so <laughs> <laughs> it's my question now. Yay. Um, how did you feel replacing uh, the last Tachanka voice actor? Was that sort of... Was there any awkwardness between you two? Uh, you know what? Uh, not really. Because, I mean, we both understand the nature of this bit. Business. And I would not be disappointed or mad if he did the same, if he accepted something that I took, that I had, that I did before. Because he's a good friend of mine, and you know what, my hat is off to you right now. Did you, did you know anything about Siege? Uh, did you know anything about Tom Clancy, the whole franchise, before you had the role? I did. I actually did, yeah. Because I actually started gaming back in 1998 or 1999. Oh, born then. So, wow. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. I started with the first Doom, Quake. I played it all, and then when the, when one of the first Siege games came out, it wasn't until Las Vegas that I really started to like this game. But unfortunately, you know, I had to give up gaming because of my you know, kids, my first kid being born, and I had to work hard and you know mm. start my own business. And I just could not continue gaming because, as you all probably know, it's highly addictive. But yeah, I would, like I said, uh, I played I played Las Vegas. Yes, it was hard. Definitely, I miss it so much. And you know, like I could never stop playing games. I knew eventually I would always come back and play again. Yeah. And like I said, now I'm 44 years old and I still game and I still play. I still have that passion in me, same as I did you know, when I was 20. Um, now, thinking about this, um, I think this might be a bit of a stupid question to ask. <laughs> yeah. um, but it's on the list, so I'll ask it. Um, what is your favorite operator? Sure. 
<laughs> what do you think? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yes, I can of course. If I cannot play him on, on the defense, I, I, I will not play. That's it. <laughs> what about on attack? I will not play. Um, <laughs> sledge. The game. It's sledge. Sledge. It's sledge 90 percent. Sledge. sledge. Mm. Okay. Yeah, I like sledge. Yeah. I mean, it's a ham. I love this mask. I mean, he being a huge strong guy, and I, I, just, <laughs> I just, you know, but like okay. I said, 90 percent of the time it's for a sledge and a jank always. Like I said. Of course. Yeah. So, if you could create an operator, what would their abilities be? Uh, you know, and this is what I this is what I mentioned to so many people. I would love to see Tachanka throw knives. <laughs> oh, <laughs> that does actually sound quite cool. And it's it's so much fun. And I'm <laughs> sure Tachanka, you know, being a Spetsna and everything, you know, like like a yeah, yeah definitely. Like yeah. I would I would love to see this in a game with more power, you know, but more mobility, definitely. Yeah, no, that's a good like, idea. Like just actually. because he's a big guy doesn't mean he's slow. He has to be slow. So, um, what's the best and worst thing about playing Siege? Uh, honestly, best thing is um, just fun. I mean, it's so addictive. I, I, I could just get into it and just spend hours just, you know, playing. And But worst thing about it is uh, not enough hours in a day. <laughs> oh. <laughs> <laughs> Definitely, yeah. Yeah. Like, you know, with all the other responsibilities and kids, I do. I just wish there was more hours in a day so I could yeah. just sit and play. Tachanka is a confirmed gamer. Then, you know. <laughs> <laughs> what is your favorite thing about voice acting? It's becoming a character, basically. You know, when I on my way to the studio, you know, this is what I think about, you know, the lines and who the guy is and how he speaks. Well, it's an hour long drive to get to the studio and it's perfect. You know, I practice my lines I'm by myself. I just get into that character. And when I go to the studio, I basically I'm Tachanka. Walking into the, in those doors, I'm, I'm Tachanka. And I just get in front of the microphone, I just deliver right away. And that's what, you know, basically guys from Ubisoft really like about me. And that's that's what I really like about voice acting, or you know, acting in general. So, uh, aside from uh, the previous voice of Tachanka, are you friends with any, or do you know any of the other voices for the operators? I know Martin Copping. I know him. I just yeah. talked to him yesterday, I believe so. Yeah, over over Instagram. Yeah, we exchanged some messages. And yeah, yeah, definitely a cool guy. Uh, yeah. Um, are you excited for the future of Rainbow Six Siege and also uh, R Six Parasite? Yes, well, definitely. I mean, aliens shooting aliens and zombies. These are my two <laughs> <Yeah>. favorite. <laughs> yeah. I mean, and if I, if I can use the Chenka, or, you know, uh, you know, Sledge, oh my God. <laughs> yeah, of course. <laughs> That's yeah. I mean, I know they worked on this project for a while, and I just can't oh, wait yeah. for it to come out. That's yeah. Exciting. We're uh, we're actually out of questions on the list, but um, I've thought of a bonus one. I thought one okay. as well. I've got a really big one. Okay. I'll, uh, I'll go first with quite a simple one. Is Tachanka's model, is it modeled off of your body? Uh, no, he was not. Now, see, that's uh, surprising, because looking at you, you're quite a big guy, you know? I am actually quite, quite bigger than he is. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> much, much stronger. That's, yeah, much that's stronger. a flex. Yeah. yeah. I'm six foot five almost. That's uh, 197 wow. Wow. 198 centimeters. Wow. And I weigh 139 kilos. <laughs> oh. Bigger than Jack. Yeah, yeah. Confirmed. I like to be oh. the most muscles. I might have to start going, Jim. So, yeah, don't you? <laughs> it's, a little, it's, a little, it's like a mean, I would, I would like to say. But yeah, he's a uh, he's a big beefy dude, definitely a strong definitely. guy, you know for sure. Yeah, yeah. So I was wondering, it was a few days ago when uh, you you spoke to some of the first pages on Instagram, and I remember you sent yeah. like a voice note, and the amount of people who were going so crazy with oh the chankers just messaged me, they, they couldn't <laughs> believe it. It was crazy, right? What? Oh, how how come you messaged the siege pages? How how come you thought you should do it? Well, you know what, like. Because, you know, I guess people found out who I was, you know, what my real name is. Yeah. And they just messaged me and they said, hey, I'm your biggest fan. Can you say LMG? Mounted <laughs> and loaded. And I mean, how could I not do? It's the least I can do. Okay. I wouldn't be here where I am if it wasn't for fans. I recorded over three to four hundred messages. Wow. Voice messages wow. for sure. <laughs> wow. 
And I That's will continue crazy. to do so. The other day, I actually sent these guys, uh, it was his birthday. So I sent them a happy birthday to you, in Tachanka's voice. <laughs> and, and then this guy, he said he's always late for his work. And he asked if I could uh, basically send him a message, you know, in the form of wake up alarm. So I did this also. <laughs> Yeah, I recorded probably over three or four hundred voice messages. Oh, wow. And this is all in the past, maybe five days. Mm. And like I said, anything I can do, like, I, I don't care. Any free time I have, I will record messages and shout outs and greetings. Like, to me, like, this is something I love to do. To me, it's the same as being in the studio, basically, and recording mm. voices and lines. Yeah. So, yeah, um, I think that's pretty much it. That's all for the questions. Um, I want to say thank you, a massive thank you for... Firstly, thank you for reaching out to me in the first place on Instagram. And thank you for taking the time out of your day to join us. Um, yeah, thank you very much. Yeah. Yeah, brilliant, I loved it. Um, absolutely amazing. Is there, um, is there anything you'd like us to promote? You know, Discord servers, Instagram, anything at all? We'll put it on screen right now. Yes, like I said, I will create, I will create a YouTube channel. Uh, and I, I I just started TikTok. Somebody suggested I should have a TikTok. So I, I you know, I, I made one. So I have a TikTok account now. Yeah. Okay. And my Instagram, of course. So anything you guys can help, you know, just to spread the word, it would be more Absolutely. Like I said. Link to, <laughs> link to all those uh, socials will be in the, uh, will be in the description. In these the videos. description. I mean, yep. Amazing. Okay. Yeah. So, um, yeah. Um, any final words? Any final goodbye messages um, to any of your fans out there? Well, I just want to thank all my fan fans from the bottom of my heart for all the support and love they've give given me. And like I said, keep following, keep, you know, promoting and, you know, anything I can do for you, I will. So that's it for the Q&A. Thank you once again so much. And thank you, the viewers. If you're up to this point, thank you for watching. And I hope you have a brilliant rest of your day.